All right, this video is going to be about how to run any Windows program on a Mac, or even if you have an outdated Windows XP. Um, Windows XP, because Windows XP, uh, as much as we all loved it, is no longer supported. Uh, we sell our software, coolmarketingsoftware.com, and it, our software requires Windows 7 or later. And sometimes that's been a problem with people who have Macs or people who still have XP. And I found a really great solution, and that solution is to get your own virtual Windows VPS. And all that is, is a Windows machine hosted at, at a, a server place with um, from a web hosting company. It's, it's you're basically leasing Windows web hosting, and it sounds complicated, but it's not. All it is, it's just the Windows machine, like Windows 7 or Windows 10. Uh, it's very similar, almost exactly the same but it's hosted somewhere else. And the advantage is, is it's on 24 seven. You just have to log in uh, with Windows remote and you can get your software running, no problem. And it doesn't rely on your home computer. You could log in from your home computer, it could be a Mac, it could be Windows VPS, but um, the remote VPS server, which is just a Windows machine, like any Windows computer, like you know Windows 7 or 8 or 10 that you use, um, it's hosted at a hosting company and you log in from your computer from anywhere in the world. You could be at work, you could be at the airport, and you can just log in, set up your programs, let them run, log off, and the server, the virtual server, is on 24-7. So this is a great way if you have a Mac or Windows XP and you can't run some software on your computer, just get these this Windows virtual vps they're cheap and you can't run any program i'm going to show you exactly how that works okay so what you first have to do is once you sign up for the windows uh, virtual server the vps you're going to get a, an email and it's going to give you a login so what you do is on your current computer and this can be done on a mac too okay well, i'm going to type in remote So what you type in is remote desktop connection. Here it is. It's on um, already on all Windows computers, even XP, and you can get a version um, that is downloadable for Mac as well. It's the same thing. So you click here, and you're gonna get a login. So what you do is you go to the setup file that letter that you got from the web hosting company. You've got an IP address. You just put that in here. You click connect. And then it asks for a password. You put in your password. Connect. Click yes. And here you are. You're on your virtual Windows machine. I already have one of my softwares set up. Okay? It's that easy. You just click off some of these windows. That's it. You're basically on a Windows computer. Uh, but, but it's virtual, see, with the remote desktop connection. So if you've had any experience running any type of Windows computer and you know how that works just a little bit, uh, you know, you've got uh, your local C drive, you've got your downloads. Okay, so say you want to run some uh, uh, software that you bought from coolmarketingsoftware.com. All you do is go to your home computer. Okay, you can, this, is, this is my home computer uh, down here and you find your I'll go on that PC and you find your downloaded software say this one back page easy ad submitter I'm going to come over here and now I'm on the virtual machine this whole window is open up I right click click paste and I copy it right to the downloads folder and then all you do is right click run as administrator and it'll set up the software on your remote Windows computer. It's just a computer, just like a Windows computer, but hosted somewhere else. So it doesn't rely on your internet connection and it doesn't um, uh, rely on your computer other than to connect to it with the remote desktop connection. So then all you do is you run the software, okay? Here, I was submitting some ads before, but I click run. 
I run the software just as if uh, it was on uh, my Windows machine on my computer, except there's a huge advantage. The huge advantage is I can log off here. And since this remote computer is on 24 seven, it keeps running the software. Uh, even if I'm not logged in uh, on my home computer. See, once I log off here, the computer, the remote server stays online. All right. So this is a great way for you to for you to run your software. And I have updated Windows software on all my computers, but I still use this because I use it for my outsourcers. I give them the username and password. They can go on and run run programs 24 seven for me. Uh, it frees up my home computer. I don't have to have bots running on it all the time. I can just dedicate that to this server. And it only costs like $10 a month. The one I'm using here costs $10 a month. That's really is not a lot considering that you could put all your windows programs on here, all the stuff that you buy from the captcha is solving right here. Just so you know, okay. Um, you could put all the programs that you want to run. You could run them all at once. Okay. And, you could be a lot more efficient. You don't have to tie up your regular computer. And if you have XP or Mac, no problem. There is remote desktop connection for both XP and Mac. It is free. You just log in to the remote Windows machine and here posting ads and you can have this running 24 seven. So I hope this gives you an idea on how to run software. Uh, if you have a Mac or outdated XP, which I'm running into a lot of people who do, um 24 7 virtually now what i'm going to do here i'm just going to log off my remote de uh, session will be disconnected but guess what it's still running it's still running i can turn off my home computer it's still running i can log back in and it will still be running let's check okay i've got my remote desktop connection open i already put in the IP address and I just put in the password. I've already copied that copy and paste it and let's see if the program is still going. Let's log in. Click yes. There you go. It's still running. I log off and it's still running. So even if you have windows uh, on your computer, you might consider this because you could have a lot of different bots running. 24 seven, um, um, completely independent of your, of your home computer or internet connection. Okay. So this is just food for thought here. I'm going to stop the program. I'm going to log off, but if I want it, I could just have it going all day long. I hope this gives you some good ideas on what to do. If you want to get a windows VPS, the best deal I found was with IO zoom. There are other places, but I thought for 10 bucks a month for, uh, the, uh, the size of server, it was great and they're a very good company. So you can try them, click the link in the description. There should be a link to a blog post where you can get links to where you can order it. Um, so you should be good. All right. So now you know how to run any windows program on a Mac or even an outdated windows XP and how to do it 24 seven from anywhere in the world. All right. For just 10 bucks a month. I think it's a good deal. Any questions? Let me know. This is Matt. Quick Register SEO and cool marketing software.com.